guys, I am back with my fairy loot for the month of September 2020. This actually, I'm like actually filming this on time for once. <laughs> Go me! Um, I think this came in like yesterday or maybe the day before, but yeah, I don't usually film them this quickly, so yay! <laughs> so this is a young adult subscription box. Um, I'll put the website and the price points down below for anyone who is interested. I did previously have like three of these young adult sub boxes on my channel but because I've been changing up some of my boxes I had to get rid of some of my boxes because monies. So this is the only young adult box that I ended up keeping. So here is that. So there is that. Voice has this little quote. And there is the pretty box art. Let's shift this to the side. And the theme for the month, which is very cool, is Under the Sea. That is some gorgeous artwork, if only glare was not an issue. It's like very dark outside, so I don't have any background light to help me, unfortunately. So let's just get going. Oh, that's cute. Actually, that's good, because mine's kind of falling apart. So I got a tangle brush, which is very cute. And I have one, but it's actually kind of like really falling apart, so this is actually perfect. I can replace that one. So that looks just very like ocean -y, but I'm assuming it's from something specific. Nope, it's not. It's just a hair detangling brush. So, cool. That works. That I will definitely use. Then we have this box, which is the mug, and it's from To Kill a Kingdom, which I have not read, but hopefully I like the mug design. Uh, oh, it's a Little Mermaid. That's cute. Yeah, I'll definitely use that. I can change out my mug. Right now I've been using the other one that I got from them that was from Serpents and Dove, Doves. So, that's really cute. And then it says, it's like holding a story rather than a person. She feels wild and intimate in this, in my, <sighs> infinite, in my army? I don't know. I can't really read that. I don't know if you guys can really read that. Darn you, that cursive thing. Let's see. <clears throat> oh, it's not. <laughs> it, it, it looks like, okay. I mean, so this is actually the characters from To Kill a Kingdom, but does this not look like Ariel and Eric? Come on now. Like, if I put that downstairs, like, anyone who sees it is going to be like, oh, cute, Little Mermaid. So, you know, I just won't correct them because it looks like the Little Mermaid. But it is To Kill a Kingdom. Is that a retelling of the Little Mermaid? Maybe. I don't know. Um, the next thing that I got is in this very loot baggy. It sounds metal. Beach, please. <laughs> Make waves. So they're like metal, no, plastic, metal, geez. metal straws. This one's huge though. I've never seen, gotten one this big, and then obviously the little cleaner for them both. Which is cool. I've never gotten one so small or so big, so that's kind of neat. Go with all the others I've acquired from the Benny mini subscription boxes. Oh, this is cool. Okay. The next thing I got is a pouch. Uh, don't grant all the princess requests, darling girl. Men are always asking for more than they should. <laughs> the sea witch. Okay. So it's got it on both sides. This is actually really cool. It's huge. I like that. 
just black on the inside. But that is actually really, really cool. Cool. Um, so the metal straws are just metal straws. Um, <clears throat> pencil case, quote from the Sea Witch, cool, from Ink and Wonder, there's that. Uh, let's see what else is hidden in here. In the bookie book. Oh, there's something there. Okay, that is up. So there's something in this guy. Looks, feels. Oh, it came off of the thing we did add. So there was this, which had the keychain on it, but it fell off. So here it is. Can you guys see? I really wish I had better light outside. I have this sad little light here, but it really usually helps to have like outside light, but there is no outside light right now. Poor unfortunate souls. <laughs> I like it, but I might give it to my cousin because my cousin loves Ursula. So I feel like she would appreciate that a lot more than I did. So that is, yeah, the unfortunate souls keychain inspired by Ursula. It's designed by Love You More Studio. And then there are tarot cards, but they did actually send us an email saying that they were stuck in customs. So we would be getting those um, in the next box, which is fine. And then here we've got the book. Let's try not to lose the bookmark like we did the last time. I totally did the last time. So here is the bookmark, which is awesome. And with the other bookmarks it goes. <laughs> then we also have a postcard from Atlantis, which is cute. So it's just a normal postcard, but that's cute. The fairy scoop. The really pretty letter from the author Ooh, which is typed instead of handwritten which is interesting and then there is the book fable which i've actually never heard of and oh i love pretty sprite edges i love you so this is also of course signy signed And then, traitor, fighter, survivor. As the daughter of the most powerful traitor in the Narrows, the sea is the only home 17-year-old Fable has ever known. It's been four years since her father abandoned her on the legendary isle island filled with thieves and little food. To survive, she must keep up to herself, learn to trust no one, and rely on the unique skills her mother taught her. The only thing that keeps her going is the goal of getting off the island, finding her father, and demanding her rightful place beside him and his crew. To do so, Fable enlists the help of a young trader named West to help her get off the island and across the Narrows to her father. But Fable soon finds that West isn't who he seems. Together they will have to survive more than the treacherous storms that haunt the Narrows if they're going to stay alive. Oh, okay. So she wrote The Girl the Sea Gave Back, which I think I ended up DNFing. So hopefully I like this one better. But it looks cool. So there is that. Then the fairy ski. I'm not sure what the theme for next. Oh wait, it says on the back of the fairy ski. Oh, oh, gosh, I keep ripping the fairy scoop. <laughs> oh, so this is a exclusive redesigned cover. Doesn't really show me the difference from the old cover, but sprayed edges and signed, obviously. So it actually has information about the author, things like that. And then the next month's theme is Wicked Hearts, 
Would you make a deal with the devil? What would you be willing to sacrifice to get what you desire most? Sometimes the devil you know is better than the devil you don't. Everything in this box is inspired by characters with wicked hearts. The morally gray characters that we love. You can expect items inspired by Carnival. Still haven't read it. The Young Elites. Nope. Castlevania. No. Star Wars. Okay, well I've watched those. And also by our featured book of the month. We are thrilled to reveal that this box will have a stunning gilded playing card deck. Ooh, fun. That will have the following fandoms, The Shadow Between Us, The Beautiful, Sorcery of Thorns, yay, I've read that one, and The Beautiful, I've read those both, and even The Darkest Stars. We cannot wait for you to see this in our wicked box. Our featured book of the month is a very highly anticipated release <clears throat> by a best-selling author. It's set in Italy, has witches, demons, romance, and even a deadly mystery. We've gone all out with this um, edition. It will have an exclusive cover stenciled in sprayed edges. Ooh. Artwork on the reverse, foil design on the hardcover, and a printed signature on the title page. It will also come with a signed book plate and exclusive bonus chapter. Very cool. Very loot. Very cool. So that is everything that came in this box. Um, I actually like this box a lot. The mug is cool. The hairbrush I will use. The pouch I will use. Um, I mean, the this is cool. I'm just going to give it to my cousin because she'll appreciate it more. And I mean, I always use straws. So that's very cool. So I'm, I'm quite pleased with this box. So anyways, I hope everyone enjoyed this unboxing. I will see you guys later for the next video. Everyone have a very good rest of the day.